as you say, a long week, uh, tough fixtures, uh, tough performances, dogged performances, shall I say. Um, but back at our home this weekend, looking forward to another big crowd. We know what we know what kind of atmosphere can be generated at Hillsborough, and uh, over the past two or three seasons, some of the some of the atmospheres under the lights on Saturday afternoons, three o'clock, um, can be. In my opinion, Hillsborough is one of the most intimidating uh, stadiums for, for any opposition to come to, any opposition fan to come to. Read about a lot after games, uh, win, or, uh, win, draw or lose. Um, the amount of supporters from opposition teams say uh, that the atmosphere at Hillsborough is unbelievable. Now, I fully understand that um, performances have been a little bit up and down, but it wasn't that long ago that we beat Leeds at Hillsborough. Atmosphere was red hot, and I'm sure it'll be the same again on Saturday. You, you, you touched on it there with performances, but it's two points away from home in ordinary circumstances, of course. Great points, but you've got to do it at home. Yeah, I mean, I think if you look at it, over the past two or three seasons, I don't think we've won down at Reading for a while, so we've got a point. But I think I think we're all honest enough to hold our hands up and say, listen, unbeaten in six, what lost lost one of our last eight or something on the face. So that stats are stats are good, but other than a couple of performances, we know we can improve. We know where we need to improve. Um, I think supporters know uh, that we need to improve as well. So we're, hey, we're all singing together. We know the fans are still on our side. Um, I understand that there's uh, some uh, disappointment at times, but if the fans weren't on our side, we wouldn't have 3,000, 3,500 fans going down to Reading on a freezing cold uh, November afternoon. They were brilliant again. Uh, the support down at Ipswich was unbelievable considering the midweek, the length of the trip and they'll turn out in their thousands again on Saturday and they'll be cheering on that blue and white strip. Listen, I get it. I get Hillsborough. I've been here long enough as a player. I've been through disappointing performances when I pulled the boots on. On the coaching side of it, we've seen ups and downs. We've seen a hell of a lot more ups and than downs over the last couple of seasons. So when you go through a so-called sticky patch, when um, results have been so-so and performances have, can be better, 90% of the time it's up to the players to get the crowd on their feet, to get the crowd singing, to get the crowd going. And we've done that on occasions, and, and I revert back to the Leeds situation. Um, but on the odd occasion, when the players are going through a hard time or finding it hard to get into things, um, the fans can make such a difference. And listen, the old adage, they can be that 12th man. And they've certainly done that uh, when I was a player and they've done that over the last couple of seasons on, uh, on many occasions to lift the team. And we need to be together. We need to be a unit. We need to be um, a family again, that Wednesday family that everybody talks about. And um, I'm sure they will be against Hull.